In early 2020, I began speaking how the year 2020 is not just the start of a new decade, but it's also the start of a new order of disruption across the world. The Renaissance is a period in European history marking a transition from the Middle Ages to modern territory and covering the 15th and 16th centuries. The era of creative distinction is the Aeon which started from 2017 and will lead into the 2040s which will see an unprecedented transformation and exponential growth of AI and technology. ChatGTP4 was officially announced on March 13th, 2023. ChatGTP4 can read, analyze or generate up to 25,000 words of text and write code in all major programming languages. It can also solve difficult problems with greater accuracy thanks to its broader general knowledge and problem-solving abilities. Some of the World Economic Forum top skills of the future include analytical thinking and innovation, active learning and learning strategies, complex problem solving, critical thinking and analysis, creativity, originality and initiative. Can you see the correlation between the skills of ChatGTP4 and the skills of the future which has already started? It's my belief by 2035 we will see AI so developed that 1. AI will be in business with each other trading goods and services 2. AI will be trading with humans goods and services in real time 3. We may even see neighbourhoods and areas of just AI robots It may sound far-fetched but movies such as AI, Artificial Intelligence, iRobot and Surrogates was nothing but predictive programming of what's to come. So with this truth, what will you do? How will you position yourself and will you be strategic, intentional and focused in learning, understanding and applying what I created and call value-driven disruption? In this era of creative distinction, it's now human, natural intelligence versus AI, artificial intelligence to see who can create disruptive value at speed. Truly, there's no time to be lazy, lethargic and lifeless, but rather it's time to be disruptive, it's time to be deliberate and it's time to be distinctive. And when you're disruptive, deliberate and distinctive, you're actually in leadership. But what is leadership? Leadership isn't about age, but rather leadership is about influence, impact and inspiration.